What is going on guys not far from gaming here or Jacob and we are back once again playing some more Clash Royale and today guys We're gonna be going over kind of like a P.E.K.K.A goblin barrel slash night goblin barrel Kind of reminds me of like the night graveyard except it's with goblin barrel and freeze uh, Definitely working a lot in the challenges and I am out of breath right now I literally just walked all the way upstairs all the way to my room. Give me a second there we go, and thank you in the last video guys for not commenting. Oh my god, what happened to your forehead? Because, like I said, I have no idea, and I'm very, very surprised that not a single person commented on the video saying what happened to your forehead. Thank you very much, and I know someone's gonna go back and comment it, because I respond to every single comment. Even the comments on, like, my first videos, people still comment on them, like, Yo, this was, like, the cringiest thing I ever watched in my life. I'm like, thanks, man, I appreciate it. Anyways, let's go ahead and hop into the deck real quick. So it is a 4.0, and as you can see, I have a level 5 Goblin Barrel. It could be level 6, but I'm only using this deck in the challenges. This is more of a Grand Challenge slash Classic Challenge deck only. Haven't tried it out in Ladder yet. Maybe I will uh, after I upgrade my Goblin Barrel and get to playing it a little bit more. But this has been really working out. They have the Golem, uh, the Giant, any, any pretty much big tanky push except for the Lava Hound. The P.E.K.K.A. can shut down, and also the Executioner with the Tornado paired up is unbelievable, guys. That should be in almost every single one of your decks, unless it absolutely cannot fit in there. But let's go ahead, and we're going to hop into one replay, just because I want to show you guys that even though you might be losing, or it's a long game, or you think it's going to be a tie, you really never know what can happen with this deck. So let's hop into that. We are going to watch this on times 4 speed just to get through it a lot quicker. But like I said, I think his right tower was down to 1900, which is only like 600 damage taken off throughout the entire match all the way till uh, double or overtime. So obviously I don't want to bore you guys, but there was a couple close, claw close calls in this game. And it, oddly enough, he had the mini or the P.E.K.K.A., which you don't really face those a lot. So kind of weird that we both matched up, but... Uh, I think at one point he says good game because we know it's just going to be a draw and we're just going to sit there, play cards, whatever. Anyways, uh, so I tried to go with the Goblin Bear right there and I froze and I was like, oh, I'm such a loser. Uh, <laughs> but I'm going to go for the Execution right there. I'm going to Tornado all that. And I was like, okay. I missed the Fireball right there. But this is where it is, right here. He says good game. I say good game because I'm thinking, you know, we're just, we're pals, right? Uh, so I'm like, what if I can make him waste his log because that is like the only counter he's got direct damage wise besides the poison that'll take it out right away so I was like okay I'm gonna go night goblin gang see if he logs it I'm gonna throw the goblin barrel right away just in case and look at that guys he's gonna go ahead and throw the log down I'm gonna freeze this this tower is gonna get shredded apart he tries to poison but it's not gonna work because of how slow it is like in last video I said I didn't like the poison because of how long it takes uh, to get its full damage in I like the fireball because it's just Straight to the point, you know? But enough about all that talking, guys. Let's go ahead and hop into a live Grand Challenge match. Looks like we are going up against FD Shy Crew. And guys, real quick, before we get into this, I just want to give a huge shout out to Moo Academy. The link to his channel will be down in the description below. He helped me with my outro. If you guys want to or you haven't seen it yet, uh, go ahead and look at it. It's the new outro. I've had it on a few videos now, and I absolutely love it. So thank you so much. It looks incredible, but let's go ahead and destroy him real quick. Um, I'm really going to ignore this, though. Okay, maybe those fire spirits I shouldn't have ignored. Level 5 Hog Rider. Yo, what? Is this fair? I don't think this is fair. Okay, no, it's fair. He's playing good. Or I suck. Probably both. Um, <laughs> that goblin is just stabbing that wizard in the side right there. It was like, bop, bop, you know. <laughs> Uh, so, wow, he's got the Goblin Barrel too, okay. Alright, alright, let's go ahead and distract this, boom. Shoom, ba-doom, 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 I don't know what that was, but he's gonna get distracted on the night, and shank, 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 the tower's done. Oh, just kidding. Ah, If he goes Hog Rider, we got the P.E.K.K.A. Boom, boom, boom. He goes Hog Rider, we got the Tornado now. Let's go ahead and Fireball this. If this takes it out, I'm going to feel so bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's so messed up. Why would they match me up with a level 8? He's got an Ice Wizard, though. Am, am I, can I really feel that bad? I'm just going to let that go. His Goblin Barrel is pretty high level. Wow, I should not have let that go. But he's going to uh, Scouts and Army that probably Fire Spirit. Okay, so he's going to 3, really? 
Why does everything bad happen to me? Cry face. You know what? Now, I'm mad. Okay, he hit me with the well played. I guess I gotta say thanks. I thought he was BMing me for a second, and I felt a little bad. Okay, now he probably thinks I'm BMing. Now I feel a little bad. Uh, but let's go ahead and go like this. We'll go like this. Chop, 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 chop. Oh, no. Wow, dude. He's just destroying my tower. Okay, so that's at three. And if I forget to take that tower out, I will be extremely mad. Freeze. Chop, chop, chop. There we go. Boom. There we go. There we go. There we go. And the Valkyrie's going to get dropped. Let's go ahead and get rid of this probably. That's probably the best idea. Let's go ahead and tornado this as well. We'll see if he drops anything. Not going to drop anything. That should be a good game though. Um, I mean, kind of what did you expect? I wasn't really trying this game. He is a level 8 after all. Not to discourage level 8s or put them down in any way, shape, or form. But I do have an advantage. Obviously, card levels and, you know, skill. He hasn't been playing as long, I'm assuming, since he's a level 8. We are only going to take one tower out. Dang. Let's get him with a good game though. And let's hop into another one because that one I don't really feel like showed its potential so like i said that last match really didn't count because he was a level eight and i had a pretty big advantage honestly uh so we're gonna go ahead and try this up against um honestly i don't know his name i i was gonna try to read it but it's not happening today guys not happening uh so i'm not really sure what he's got obviously really really you think you're funny Let's go ahead and take that executioner out. Once we take that executioner out, it'll be a lot easier, but I feel like it's not going to take it out. Thank you for lining that back up. I will appreciate that very much. Uh, and if he logs that, okay, zap. Nice zap, I guess. Um, he got nothing. Let's go ahead and goblin barrel that right there. And what do we got to do? Let's just defend this a little bit. Okay, let it hit. We could have froze and taken that entire tower out if we really wanted to. Uh, but we did do a lot of damage to the tower, so I'm not going to complain there. Let's go ahead and fireball before it charges. Before it charges. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? That was dumb. Dude, how many people are going to be running this deck? I feel like I faced this before. I faced this earlier today, and I won. But, like, it's not going the same for me right now. That was... Oh my god, if they charged again, I would have been so... Mad. That would have been literally the dumbest move ever. Uh, but I swear I just first this. Like, that P.E.K.K.A. deck that I just first was this deck and I beat it. It had the bandit. I know it did. Uh, so this is going to be kind of challenging. He's going to drop the uh, right in front. Okay, so we got to go like this. But then again, we got to make this. Hit this right here. Or tornado all that together. And it's still hitting the tower. Let's go ahead and throw that out right there. And we might have to freeze here if he doesn't have the log. Um, or we will just take some damage. Alright, I'll, I'll do that. I'll do that damage. That's alright. So 621 left. What is he going to do? I should have saved that. Never mind. Oh my gosh, what a save. What a save. Let's go ahead and goblin barrel that right there. And we'll go ahead and freeze this because we really have to uh, to get that damage off right there. And that is going to be a tower. Yeah, boy. And this guy was getting greedy going for the three crown. And it's not going to happen, honestly. I really want him to try to push for it again. Okay, he's not going to do it. He, he learned his lesson. Uh, but he doesn't have the executioner now, which is great for us, obviously. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and put this right in front. Then we're going to go over here. And we're going to fireball. Boom. Take that out. Yeah. So let's go like this. Like that. And we will go ahead and freeze it. Freeze it, freeze it, freeze it. Oh, yes. That is beautiful right there. That is a beautiful play. Uh, but what is going to be on the counter push? We don't know. Electro Wizard, okay. Um, let's go ahead and tornado all this right here. Uh, we'll go ahead and throw the Executioner up right there. Come on, take that bandit out. Don't let it charge. Don't let it charge at you. Thank you. Let's go ahead and throw the Goblin Gang right there. Uh, kind of a fail Goblin Gang, honestly. 
Uh, but we made him play something, so that's good. Let's go ahead and go with the P.E.K.K.A. right here. Bad idea by him. Wait, was it? Swing. Oh my gosh, that could have been really bad for us. Uh, but he definitely just spent a ton of elixir right there. So, if we can... Go like this. Come to Papa. Let's go like that. We'll freeze the Electro Wizard. Boom. Boom. Fireball. Boom. Good game. That's how you do it. Beat that deck twice. Let's go. So like always, I show you guys the deck at the very end of the video just in case you missed it at the beginning or you just wanted to watch the whole entire video because you're awesome. Uh, if you did make it this far in the video, let me know by commenting hashtag... No, just comment I made it, okay? I made it. That's all you have to do. Comment that and obviously I will 100% respond. I respond to all my comments, but let me know just so I can get a feel for how many people actually make it to the end. Uh, but anyways, hopefully you guys did enjoy it. I've been invited to a 2v2, so I gotta go join that in a second. But anyways, I hope you did enjoy the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.